I mean, no, phone right here. Yeah. Uh, obviously, I have to ask uh, right out of the gate. Uh, it's been a while since we last saw you. The last time we saw you on the scale, you didn't get to fight in the octagon. So how has the weight cut been before this fight? The weight cut has been very good. Not to complain. I'm already 133. So I'm all right right there. Is this, uh, is this weight low for you at this point in the fight week? Or yes. Actually, the, the most lower I had in my fight career is the lower. Did you have to make any changes in camp, or was this just something you knew you had to get ahead of? I just have to eat a lot of it. <laughs> and obviously, you're fighting Muhammad Mahayev. Uh, hmm. Going to have some like a hometown crowd here. He's trained here quite a bit. So I'm curious, what are you expecting from him when you actually do step into the octagon? I didn't believe that he's, uh, he's going to have the crowd on his side, but uh, it's going to be fun. It's going to be a good fight. You know, uh, I'm trying to make this quicker because... I had to put Mokaev in his, on his place. In my opinion, I believe this is too early for him, but we will see. Why do you think it's too early for him? It's too early. There is levels to that, to this game. Uh, he never faced a championship caliber, and uh, I see a lot of mistakes on his game. So this is what I say. It's too early for him. What have you made of his last few performances? Because we spoke to the champion Pantoja at the Hall of Fame, Fred mm. Carpet, he said he wants to see more from Mahayev if he wants to fight him. I'm curious, are you, are you in that same sense? Have you not been overly impressed with him? Yeah, Pantoja can say uh, a lot of things of him because they, they trained before together and uh, I know Pantoja been submit him a lot, a lot. He make it, he tap a lot and uh, that's the reason that Mukaev don't go more training at ATT, you know. Uh, but yeah, uh, actually, he's been doing a good job, you know. Uh, he's, he's been winning all the fights, but there is uh, a lot of mistakes. He's been struggling a lot, you know. Uh, a lot, a lot of mistakes that uh, if he face someone on uh, on uh, on top three, uh, UFC rank and flyweight, he's gonna get he's gonna get finished. So it's gonna be it's gonna be it's gonna be fun. Where did this rumor of you and him having this run-in at the, the PI start? That is no rumor. It's just people talk a lot. Uh, and we saw on your Instagram, I think you posted if, if something like, if I don't go to Dagestan, Dagestan will come to me, and you were training with those those guys at AKA. Uh, how helpful have they been for you to yeah, in preparation? Yes, of course. Of course uh, all the people in Dagestan, they, they support me. Uh, uh, they're on my side. The real, the real people, the real Dagestans, you know, uh, and actually, I feel more Dagestan than him, you know. Uh, it's just better. It's just better thing. And with the addition of Kaya Sakura to the UFC, are you viewing this as you have to put you put on an impressive performance against Mahayev to kind of cement yourself as the number one contender? Because as of right now, Pantoja doesn't have a challenger. D does he? No. Pantoja doesn't have a challenger, but some people think maybe Kaya Sakura gets the title or the winner of this fight gets the title shot. Uh can be whatever, uh, you know, uh, the timing, uh, it's just God know about timing, you know. Uh, when I came to UFC, my first fight was, a, I was a backup of the fight, you know. And right now I'm in a situation and, uh, or where I am, I'm in a good situation for for win streak. Uh, if this is a, a title contender, yes, it is a title contender. Uh, and... Uh, that is on anyone, any other fighter that uh, is on level to the fight against Patonio, if not me. Are you hoping to, when you do become champion in your mind, that you could finish this story with Kaya Sakura possibly in Japan, where you guys started your careers? Against each other? Maybe it's going to be good, you know. Uh, UFC Japan, already been fight there. 40,000 people, I can put it there, you know. So maybe it's going to be good. And one final one for me. I don't know if you heard, but on November 1st, there are going to be some new rule changes that were approved. They're going to allow 12 to 6 elbows, mm. and they've redefined what a grounded opponent is. I'm curious, did you hear this news, and what yes, did you yes. the changes? This is very good. You know, This is very good because sometimes I'm, I'm, I'm usual. And actually, it's going to be good if they put a soccer kick. You know, It's going to be very, very good. But now back here. Um, this is Phoenix with uh, Block Asset. We have a saying. It is called a burn moment, which is just a really difficult in your time or a difficult time in your life. What do you think is the biggest burn moment that you've went through that's truly made you who you are? 
No, it's not. I'm not in in um, in a hard moment of my life. My life is being very good. I've been eat very well. I drive nice car. I have a good house. You know, just uh, on 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 uh, on fight games, some things happens. You know, uh, if you guys look to the to the my historic of the fight, and most of my opponents they've been pulled out. You know, from the fight. So the problem is not on me. So I, I don't think that I'm in a hard spot. Manel up front, right here. I just want to get your thoughts on uh, who you think wins between Kai Car France and Steve Versus. How do you think that goes? It's a good fight. It's a good fight. Uh, I believe Kai Car France is more aggressive than him. It's more aggressive. He's technical, actually. Um, I don't. I think Steve Serg is better on the ground. Better on the ground, but he's very. Good. Uh, competitive fight, uh, but my my score is gonna be on Kaka reference. Um, over here, um, you've faced Alexandre Pantoja before. If you are to get a title shot, if you win this fight, how would the fight be different uh, next time around? No, uh, actually, the first fight was not a, was not a fight. We was more cautious with each other. Actually, it was not a fight. I won the third round. The second one was uh, was both competitive. Uh, it's gonna be fun. I, I believe that the next, uh, if I face him again, it's gonna be like uh, when he faced Davison Figueroa. Fight's so gonna be similar. You know, it's gonna be gonna be that type of the blood. And uh, this fight against Mahama Makayev was moved from the main card down to the early prelims. Do you know wh why that choice was made? Maybe they want to push more the audience. You know, they want to push the audience. Maybe Mokaev don't deserve the main card, you know. And uh, But for me, it's good for the timing, you know. I don't have to fight at 3, 4 a.m. So I'm going to fight at 11 a.m. and I can go out. What is your plan uh, if you are to win to celebrate? Not if you are to win. I'm going to win. And after the win, just uh, get my boys, get some good food and enjoy a little bit of time.